Hey guys, what's up? It's me, the Kevin Bear, and welcome to another video. Today, we are doing an exciting unboxing. Today, we are unboxing the Shang Shao Terramix, but from speedcubeshop.com. So, as you guys probably already know, I have been trying to get this sub cube for such a long time. Um, I saw it on sale on speedcubeshop.com during the Black Friday sale, and I just had to get my hands on it. You guys already know I have a Mega Minx, a Giga Minx, and now I'm going on to the Terra Minx. If you guys already have seen this pattern, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to get all the odd layer Mega Minx puzzles first, and then we're gonna go on to the even layer ones. Hopefully we will be able to complete our Minx collection because I did start off with a Mega Minx at first when I first started my Cuban career. It was not a regular 3x3, it was a Mega Minx. So I'm super excited to get into this. Oh my god, look at the way this thing looks. It's been pretty good. First thing we got in the box, ah uh, yeah, we got some extra stickers. It looks pretty good. Why do these look like Mega Minx stickers? Okay. Look at that. Wow. Uh, yeah, we got stickers. Don't really care about that, but look at this, guys. Wow, we. Is this a nice looking cube? You guys can see this looks pretty. It actually doesn't differ in size compared to the. Uh, it's not really that different in size compared to the Gigaminx. I feel like this is just a tiny little bit bigger, but look at all these pieces though. They look incredibly, this is a little bit luby actually. Let me go wipe this down. It's a little bit luby for my hands right now. Let me just uh, wipe it down, make sure it looks nice, and I'll be right back. Taking a look at this puzzle right here, you guys can see it looks really, really nice. It looks really good. I'm loving these colors. They look exactly the same as the ones on the Gigaminx, and those ones look great. But without further ado, let's go ahead and take some first turns at this beast. Wow. Yep. So smooth. Wow. I was not expecting it to be that smooth. Let's try out second layer. Second layers are just as smooth as the second of the first. First layers are just as smooth as well. Every layer is smooth. Wow. This looks really nice. Looking real good, I must admit. The only problem I can see right now is that these second layers are actually really hard to turn because they're grinding, they're dragging along the third layer. You guys can see they're dragging along the third layer, which uh, can bring some problems, but I don't think it'll be that bad when we actually start doing our thing. But yeah, that's the only problem I can see right there. Other than that, the, the cube looks great. It's, uh, it's a little bit big. Um, here's, I'll bring my 3x3 to compare the size of this. Here's a standard 3x3 next to it. Uh, it, is a little, it is quite a big puzzle. It's quite a hefty puzzle too. It is a little bit heavy, but you know, obviously I do not mind the heaviness at all of this cube. It looks really good. It looks really nice. I love this cube so far. So this is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is the 7x7 seven seven version of the Minx puzzles. So if you guys don't know how the Minx puzzle works, it goes uh, Kibaminx, uh, Killaminx, uh, no, Elite ki Killaminx, and then it would be Terraminx, and then Master Elite Killaminx, which is the 8x8, and then Petaminx, which is the 9x9, which is the biggest mass-produced Minx puzzle. There's obviously bigger ones, but they're not mass-produced. I would have to custom order them, and uh, yeah. But I just plan on getting all of these in the um, in the Minx collection, the mass-produced versions. If they, if they plan to release another one, you know I'll order it, but yeah, this was a really awesome deal I got from speedcubeshop.com. I really like the, I've always wanted the Terra Minx and all the Minx puzzles. I wanted a Petta Minx for such a long time since I was a cube, like a small little baby cuber. I saw a video of someone solving it, and it was like eight hour video. But it looks so cool to me and I wanted to get one. But now I have a Terraminx in hand and uh, looking at it, it looks like it's going to be a long time to actually learn how to solve, to, like, solve it. Um, but you guys already know, if you're in the mood, I got a new puzzle. So uh, let me know in the comments below if you guys want to see a tutorial on how to solve this guy. Uh, I'll try to figure out how to solve it myself before going on to make a tutorial. But I don't mind making a tutorial for this one, um, even though it'll be long and... Uh, Quite the adventure. I think we might be able to pull it off and make a Terraminx video on how to solve a Terraminx. Um, but yeah, 
look at these shades looking real nice with these shades I really like them a lot and uh, yeah well since uh, so before I leave with you guys off let's go ahead and scramble this cube and see how it looks scrambled all right first let me take a picture of this like without it being scrambled because uh, yeah let's go ahead and scramble this cube up because we both know what we want to see in this video is us scrambling up this bad boy right here so let's go ahead and scramble him up I'm going to start off with the outer layers first and make my way down. Alright, that looks like a pretty good scramble to me. It looks pretty good, I must say. It looks really, really nice. Wow. I love the way that I look. I just love the way see this is one of the reasons why I love the minx puzzle so much when they're scrambled they look so beautiful with all the colors everywhere it just looks really nice it really pops out to the eye I mean compared to a Rubik's Cube you see ow that hurt I mean compared to like you see like a Rubik's Cube scramble you're like oh it's a scramble Rubik's Cube but if you see this guy it really catches your eye and you're like wow what the freak is that bro yeah, this is going to be one heck of a beast to solve. I cannot wait to start solving it. I will be coming out with an ASMR video and a tutorial on how to solve this very soon coming up in the next couple of weeks. So be sure to stay on tune for that. Also be sure to also be sure to go ahead and enter the giveaway in my 1000 subscriber giveaway video. Once again, you guys, I cannot thank you guys enough for 1000 subscribers. We reached that milestone. We're going to keep growing. But yeah, make sure to enter that sweepstakes and let me know what you guys want me to do with this Mega Ming, with this Terra Minx puzzle. Let me know if you guys are going to get one and I'll leave a link down below to where you can purchase this on speedcubeshop.com. You better believe I'm going to get some nice scenic pictures of this Giga Minx, of this Terra Minx. And uh, I left all my cubes back in, back in college, so when I get back there, I'm going to put them side by side and see how it looks compared to the Giga Minx. Review coming soon for this puzzle. Make sure you guys are staying warm because of winter. I'll see you on the next video. It's Kirin Bar out. Peace out, guys.